guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lois. I go by the name of I'm Lois XO. You can follow me on Instagram and TikTok. I leave it right here as I always do. Guys, today I've got one of my favourite ever brands. I'm doing an ASOS haul. You guys know I love ASOS and especially ASOS design. Yeah. I just needed a wardrobe refresh. And I'm not being funny. I know I always do hauls, so I'm always getting new clothes. But I've seen a couple of new things that I like. I've seen some pinstripes, I've seen some, you know, some denim shorts, I've seen denim skirts, I've seen a couple of skirts. I'm not really into skirts, but I'm, everything I've got on Israel, I would never ever normally wear. So yeah, we're going out the boat a little bit, we're trying new things. Things. I'm also going to see Chris Brown in a couple of weeks. I need two outfits because I'm going twice. I can't remember, I'm going to three concerts like within like the next month, so I need three outfits because you can't just wear something in your wardrobe, you have to get something new to be squishing a crowd. Um, if you're not following me on TikTok already, then go follow me. I have content like this, things that I haven't included in the haul. Just quickly, this is one thing that I'm going to keep. Um, I had to reorder it because it was pop was damaged. I want to wear it to Chris Brown. So this is what it looks like. It's a jumpsuit and it's collusion. The bottom popper, it didn't pop, like with it on or off, so I had to reorder it, which is so annoying, but I really, really like it. So so, yeah, I'm waiting for that to come. And yeah, if you, like I said, if you don't follow me on TikTok, go and follow me because you'll get exclusive videos and outfits before I upload it on YouTube. Anyway, let's not waste time. I've got a nice full rack. I think this was um, about £290. Let's get into the haul. First things first, this is a black pinstripe boob tube dress, and I've got this in a size 18, and it's from the brand Extro and Vert. Wow, I've never actually heard of it before, if I'm completely honest, but I do love a pinstripe number. So, this is what it looks like. I'm not sure if you've watched my last haul, but I had a pretty little thing haul, and I got like a denim boob tube dress, and I was like, this is actually quite nice. So, I'm actually going to just venture out and just get some more boob tube stuff, because I think with the right bra, this could look absolutely fantastic. I still haven't got that right bra, but if you do want a bra haul for a larger bust, let me know and I will film it, because I do need to go bra shopping, and it'll give me an excuse to do so. This is the dress. Again, it's in a size 18. It's got a bit of stretch to it. No, it doesn't. I mean, it's got a slight bit of stretch at the top, but halfway down it doesn't stretch. So I think it's just this top bit that has a little bit of stretch. It's also got one of those really thin zips. I don't think I'm going to need to use the zip, if I'm being completely honest, because it stretches. But it's not straight. It's kind of got that, like, boob. I don't know, it dips in the middle. I don't know what it's called. You guys know me. My, you know, vocabulary is not amazing. Let's see what it looks like. On. Okay, so this is the dress. What do we think? I really, really like it. Obviously, like I said, I do need to get a bra that's, like, strapless, because right now my straps are just tucked in. But... It's a nice dress. I feel like this even just take it in your suitcase, like go on holiday in it. You can wear it to a night out, you can wear it to a dinner, you can wear it, apart from that, I don't know. But yeah, you can wear it out in the evening, you can wear it to a dinner, it's smart casual as well. Um, you could wear it with tights, you could wear like a long black suit top under it if you really wanted to as well. Like, you can just style it so many ways and yeah, I don't know what it is about boot shoes recently, but I'm really, really liking them. So yeah, this is definitely going to be a keeper. Quality is lovely. It has one of those like silicone things so that this sticks to you so it can't fall down as well, which I think is a really nice touch because not every dress that I've tried on in the past has that. It's actually quite rare to find that. Yeah, I really, really like this one. This one's definitely going to be a keeper. Next is another pinstripe number. This is in a size 18 and it's ASOS design. Now it's a dress, a waistcoat top, and then it just goes straight down at the bottom. Actually quite hard to show you, I'm not going to lie. This is what it looks like. And I saw the model in this and I said, you know what, you look so good. And I thought, it's so nice because this could be dressed down with trainers or it could be dressed up. You could have like a nice long like black or any like base layer on underneath, right to work with tights and boots. Like you could just have it um, with a nice cleavage and wear it with heels to go out, dress it down with trainers. Like, I feel like this is a very versatile piece. It's not out of my comfort zone, but it is out of my comfort zone, if that makes sense. Yeah, um, quality, amazing, nice materials, blazing material. You know I love a good blazer, so I think that's probably why I really like this. So yeah, I'm very interested in this. Let's see what it looks like on. Honestly, my hair's throwing me off. I had to like, just give it like a little blow dry because you guys know I've got scalp psoriasis and I couldn't get a comb through the curls, like a fine tooth comb. So yeah, we'll be going back curly literally, what, tonight or tomorrow when I wash my hair. It just looks crazy. Anyway, so this is the waistcoat dress. I. I'm in love with this dress. I'm actually in love with this dress. I think it's like one of the most nicest dresses I've ever tried on. Um, I think it's quite flattering, it's quite figure hugging. Obviously I've got like a larger bust. Um, I would wear a black bra with it obviously as well, but for the purpose of this video I'm wearing a white one. The black one's in the wash. I like it. I mean, I could wear a long sleeve black top under this, tights like I said, and I could wear this to the office. Um, if I had like a high neck or even like a turtle neck on. Um, also, I could wear it just like this. I could wear it out. I could wear it to a dinner. I could wear it to the club. I could also wear it out in the day, afternoon tea, lunch with the girls, shopping, go to the theatre. I could wear this anywhere. Like I feel like it's a very versatile piece. It's smart casual, but at the same time, it's quite it's different. I don't think I've seen this. I know it does kind of look like I'm going to work, but at the same time, like I just think it's a really nice dress. Small zips, it zips up the side, and then you put this on, do the buttons up, good to go. Yeah. I do really like this one. Next, I got this ASOS Design shirt in a 2XL. I thought it was collusion, actually. I literally only picked this up as a beach cover for a holiday. Not that I'm going anywhere. This is what it looks like. I thought over a nice little black swimming costume. That could be cute. Um, love that. Let's see what it looks like on. It is a 2XL. That's the smallest size they had. So let's see what it looks like on. Okay. <laughs> this is like 
way too big, first of all. Um, I don't know what I was expecting, but it just wasn't this. I thought it would be a nice cover up or to wear like denim shorts. But to be honest, it just makes it look like a huge bin bag. I'm definitely gonna be sending it back. Um, but they only had two XL and three XL left, so I'm not, obviously I know it's meant to be oversized, but it just doesn't really look that good. It looks like um, like a nighty or like a, I just look stupid. I, look, I don't know what I look like. I look like I've gone into my into my grandma's wardrobe and I've just took one of her um, tops because I ruined my clothes and I have nothing to wear. That's what I look like. So it's going back. Um, I do like the print though. I really like the print. Next, I bought these Urban Bliss denim shorts and I got them in a size 18. These are just like a long line denim short and it's got like a little a little thing there, like a little bit of detail and I just thought that was really nice. I think they're meant to be fitted. It's like a fitted jean, which is what I just wanted. I don't know. I don't know what top I'd wear it with, but I thought maybe for the summer or again for a holiday because your legs can't chafe in these. When you're a plus size girl like me, you don't want a chafe in legs. Yeah, I like the detail. Never heard of Urban Bliss before. They've got pockets on the side of the legs, on the back of the legs, on the front of the legs. So they look like on. I've got a top to try on with, so ignore the top, but I'm not feeling these at all. Oh my gosh, things, I bought a pair of these from Primark like about a year and a half ago, and um, every time I put them on, I was like, they look vile. This is the same situation. This is literally, let me just pop that back like that. This is the same situation. They're not flattering. Maybe because I'm short as well, they just don't look good. They look really silly, so they will be a 100,000% send back. Next, I picked out this ASOS design denim skirt in an 18. It's giving me Y2K vibes. Really want a denim skirt. Again, this could be a potential for Chris Brown. I just need to figure out like a top to wear with it, but it's, it's a potential, it really is. Yeah, this is definitely a potential, but it's a denim skirt and it's got a thick a slightly thicker waistband and then it's got these really nice pockets and I just thought that is a bit of me even if I didn't wear it to Chris Brown I'm sure I could wear it in the summer to a festival do you see where I'm going with it? I feel like the vibe is there. Usually with a denim skirt, I'd actually size up to a 20, but I've been wearing a lot more like size 18s recently. So I just thought I would give it a go. Hopefully it fits. Let's see what it looks like on. Again, ignore the top, but this is the skirt. I would wear a black top with this, to be honest, because I wear a light top, I'm gonna look very top heavy. I would wear like a lighter color. So I'd wear like a black top with this, just to let you know. And I'm actually quite short. So I've got, for an 18, I've got quite a bit of room in there, which is nice. Yeah, I like it. YTK skirt, it's short. I like short shorts and short skirts. I like the pockets. It's just very simple, but it's very put together. This is like a standard thing I would wear in the summer. I really, really like it, actually. I think usually, because it's Y2K, it's obviously a lot shorter. Usually when I get a denim skirt, it's long. It doesn't suit me very well, I think, because of my height. Um, I am five foot three, five foot four. So, yeah, I think that could be the reason. But, yeah, this is nice. And then, last but not least, I got this ASOS Design Curve Range skirt. And it's a leather, very leather skirt in a size 20. I got this for work. I just thought, tight skirt... Or even like for like when I'm going like shopping on a weekend or something like I can have something that's a little bit more nice. Yeah, it's for me like I never used to be able to wear a skirt that never used to suit me, but I'm just trying to like go out of that comfort zone now. I quite like the length, but it looks like it's gonna be a little bit flowy. It's soft, it does have a stretch to it, and it has one of those small zips at the back as well. You know that I don't usually like that, but we're giving it a go today, you know? Because they're usually quite flimsy, they just break, but let's see what it looks like on. This is the foil of a skirt. And I don't like it. It's too like wide here. Or is it? I don't know. I don't think I like it. I'm, I'm going to be sending it back. I'm sorry. I'm going to be sending it back. This is a 20, so I actually probably could have stayed in an 18, but um, I actually can fit my whole arm in there. I thought it was going to be cute. Maybe I need to reorder an 18 and have a look at what it looks like, but for me, it's just not really doing much. I just think it makes you look a bit... I think there's nothing for me, to be honest with you. I don't really like it. Um, that's me being completely honest. The skirt is lined, though, and the quality is nice. Very, very soft. I don't know how it would wash up, but... Yeah! I think maybe it's a bit very showy here as well. It's just not the it's not the nicest. I and mean, even with like leather leggings, like I get them and then like I'll put them on for, with an outfit or think, yeah, I'm gonna wear leather leggings tonight. Every time I'm like, no, I'm taking them back off. I don't know what I think about it. I think what I'm trying to say, quality is nice, does it suit me? I don't know. Guys, that is the end of the video. I really do hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you are new to join the family. I'd love to have you around. My favourite is definitely the pinstripe. My favourite is definitely the waistcoat dress and the denim skirt and obviously the jumpsuit. Let me know what, if I should wear any of those to Chris Brown. Because I would happily even wear that to Chris Brown. I mean, the first one I'm sitting right at the back, the second one I'm, I'm standing in the crowd. So, um, yeah, let me know. As always, most of the stuff on the rail is ASOS Design. ASOS Design is one of my favourite brands. You get good quality for your money and their clothes really do last. So. Yeah, I love it. And you guys know that I always give my honest opinion because my hauls aren't sponsored. And if they were sponsored, I would let you know. Anyway, that's it. I'm going to go. I hope you enjoyed. My name is Lois. I go by the name of I'm Lois XO. You can follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you're right here as always do. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.